In this video, we'll be talking about Monero and I'll be giving you around five reasons why I love this cryptocurrency. I've made a little slideshow here for you guys. So let's just get right into it. Um, I'm just going to swap the screen right here. So first of all, Monero is this private untraceable currency. And this is what we're going to read a little bit uh, about here. So unlike selectively transparent alternatives like Zcash, it's another private privacy coin. Uh, Monero is the only cryptocurrency where every user is anonymous by default. The sender, receiver and amount of every single transaction are hidden through the use of, uh, of three important technologies that I won't get into. Every transaction is private. Monero cannot be traced. This makes it a true uh, word that I can't pronounce currency. Merchants and individuals accepting Monero do not need to worry about blacklisted or tanned coins. I don't know if you know this guys, but if you have Bitcoin or some other not private currency sitting in a wallet and you then want to transfer that uh, over to an exchange to sell it and get your profit, well, then there can be incidents where your coins are tanned uh, and a Bitcoin that is normally worth tens of thousands of dollars uh, could be worth a couple hundred dollars because and also your account on your exchange will instantly be uh, locked down because you have this tanned coin. Um, so that can be a coin that has been used on the dark web or something uh, for something illegal. And then um, it is kind of, uh, it, it is blacklisted in a way. Um, so that is uh, one of the, one of the disadvantages with these open blockchains uh, where you can just go in and see everything. And we'll get to that uh, right here uh, because let me just go out here again, right there. Um, yeah. Monero is leading. Uh, Monero is the leading cryptocurrency focused on private and censorship resistant transactions. The majority of existing cryptocurrencies, including Bitcoin and Ethereum, are trans have transparent blockchains, which I just talked about. Transactions can be verified or traced by anyone in the world. This means that uh, the sending and receiving address of these transactions would be potentially could be linked to real world identities. Not many people know how transparent uh, pretty much every single crypto that isn't a, a privacy coin is. And let me show you this guys, because here you go into blockchain.com, blockchain.com right here. You go into explore here. You can see everything guys. You can see the blocks mind here. You can see all of the latest transactions. You can see uh, this wallet, uh, send this amount of Bitcoin which is worth, uh, what is that? $114,000. You can see that and that happened, uh, yeah, probably a minute ago. And this guy sent uh, some more Bitcoin and you can see every single time someone sends Bitcoin, you can see it. The thing is, this is a problem, guys. The fact that you can just see every single transaction is a problem if uh, coins like Bitcoin and Ethereum uh, is going to be used like an, a, a currency in the world that you get your pay through, that you pay, pay your bills and your rent with. You don't want every single person in the world to see, oh, now uh, this wallet here, which we can uh, link to a, a real world person uh, at some point, if, you, if you've seen that address uh, some other place, then you can link that. And then you can, uh, although you know, might not think it's a problem, it is a problem. And um, you don't want everyone to, to be able to see whatever you spend your money on. And especially if it's like huge investors and huge uh, anonymous people who want to uh, make large transactions, uh, then you don't want uh, people to, to see those transactions. So that is why Monero has its edge. And the fact that um, Monero is leading in uh, the private cryptocurrency uh, space is a huge, huge bonus. Um, yeah. Something that really gets me hooked on a crypto guys is when they are developing, when they're developing and developing and developing and there's a nice, good management team that I just, yeah, that is the absolute best thing that I can see in a cryptocurrency. And here we have just what I'm talking about. So the Monero project is uh, at the forefront of crypto privacy and security. Its research lab and development team are consistently working on a new innovative technologies since it since its launch the project has received contributions from over 500 developers located all around the world so uh 
yeah, this is great, guys. There are talented engineers and a great community of people constantly developing on the coin and making it more usable. That is what makes this uh, the best privacy coin out there. So, uh, Monero is uh, electronic cash that allows fast um, inexpensive payments uh, to and from everywhere in the world. With Monero, there's no wire transfer or check clearing fees, but no multi-day holding periods and no fraudulent charge ba chargebacks uh, because Monero is decentralized, also incredibly important. Um, it is not constrained by any particular legal uh, restriction and provides safety from capital control. Um, so basically what they're trying to, to do here is they want to make Monero as electronic cash. Basically, no check clearing, no fees, no nothing, guys. This is just a currency. A currency, this, this right here is just a currency that you can give to people and receive, and there's no fraudulent chargebacks, so no coins will be tanned. Um, every coin is worth the same, and um, there's no clearing fee, there's no clearing time, and there's no fees. That is what they're uh, going to try and make, and they're developing on uh, just that. So all this information taken into consideration, I think this coin is great for several reasons. There's things that I would like to see the coin implement, which was uh, proof of stake. First of all, it still uses proof of work, which is kind of old school nowadays. But that said, Bitcoin uses that uh, still and Bitcoin Cash and all these uh, big names out there still uses proof of work. So it's not like it isn't possible. Um, I would like to see yeah, proof of stake. Um, but pretty much they, they've got pretty much everything. They've got a decent transaction speed, which is very important, much better, like four times better than Bitcoin. So not insanely good, but much better than Bitcoin. Um, and we have decentralized, also incredibly important, which Bitcoin also lacks. Um, we have privacy, which sets it apart from 99% of all coins out there. There's other competitors to Monero, the privacy coins, but they are not uh, anywhere near this stage uh, where Monero is at. So um, it's it's not very often that you can say uh, that our cryptocurrency is leading in something. As you know, it's the best one. It's the best one. Bitcoin, I wouldn't say it's the best in anything, in anything other than being the biggest. And, you know, I could say Cardano, I, I think it's the best in, in uh, some things and probably Ethereum also. Um, but Monero is like rank 29 in the world cryptocurrency but it still is the best at something so that is something that is very important um yeah so you can find a lot of information about wallets and what they stand for and all sorts of things here uh, on their website i would really recommend take, uh, taking a look at this and um yeah 